everybody, my name is Juliane and I'm visiting Connor today because this MT-07 is going to get a Magura High Mac. So, and there I see he's coming already. <laughs> Hi Connor. Welcome to my workshop. Thanks so much. Nice Thanks for having me. You. Nice yeah. to see you too. And so we get it inside and put it on? Yes, let's do this. All right, and here it is. This is it. Um, this particular model is pre-filled, especially for your Yamaha. Um, as you can see, we have a pre-filled system ready to install. The activation rod is completely withdrawn, mm -hmm. so it's actually hitting the cap here at the bottom, which means that the, the lever is hydraulically blocked but in this position it can't get any air in the system and we also have um, some instructions and some bits to complete the build. Alright Connor, and generally for which motorcycles is the Hymex system? Um, the Hymex system can basically be fitted to almost anything that has a cable activated clutch. Mm -hmm. um, we would say about 90 or 95% of motorcycles. And uh, for some of the more popular models, we have a pre-filled kit. Um, you can check that on our website mm -hmm. in the activation list. Oh, okay. um, and the Haymic really has, uh, is a strange product because mm -hmm. people who, who ride professionally um, in enduro sport or whatever who activate the clutch a lot and mm. um, they have a huge advantage because they can always feel exactly what's happening they have the same pressure point every time they activate the clutch um, and of course somebody who has a small hand or less power in their hand um, also has you know a big advantage from using the Heimek. Very good okay I think let's get to it right? Yeah. <laughs> There is the high mag on the MT-07. Yeah, um, just a couple of things to point out. Um, oh, it's naturally, much easier. <laughs> naturally, I can change the position of the, mm -hmm. the lever. Okay, I think it, it works great the way it is. Okay, excellent. Um, you also have the possibility here with the breakaway lever. Oh, wow. um, if the bike should ever fall over on you, mm -hmm. it's unlikely that the lever will break. Nice. You can also set the set the the reach just very simply here. Um, I've set it here on a small hand setting because I know <laughs> that um, my fingers are small. <laughs> yeah. And yeah. one last thing, just to show you on the with the steel cylinder, mm -hmm. um, you have four to six millimeters of free play here mm -hmm. against the internal spring. When the clutch gets warm, it'll move away from the slave cylinder. So it's always a good idea once, once a year when the bike is properly warm, just to make sure that you still have just a little bit of free play here. Okay. Yeah, mm -hmm. when it's warm. And uh, enjoy the hammock. That's it, awesome. Okay, thank you so much. You're very welcome. <laughs> 